वेलकम टू द फ्रेंड माई नेम इज़ आमना बेगम एंड दिस वीक वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट डबल किस वानो केस सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल दिस केस आई हैव आई हैव सीन इन टू दिस केस फ्राम वेरियस परस्पेक्टिव फ्राम लीगल एंड फ्राम द सोशल एज वेल सो आई रिमेंबर वेन आई रेड दिस न्यूज दैट प्रिपरेटर ऑफ सच एनियस क्राइम आर गेटिंग मर्सी बाई द स्टेट गवर्नमेंट आई वॉज वेरी इन in rage and um, just like the most of the uh, indian citizen this doesn't make any sense that uh, why do these people deserve uh, any kind of mercy without showing any redemption and also the worst was the knowing that there is certain organization uh, i think vhp which galne galant this uh, perpetrator i mean they 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 were celebrating what celebration of rape of women celebration of such a heinous crime just because of the communal angle into it it is a very very wrong kind of uh, uh, precedent to set and a wrong message however before going into this uh, mindset first i looked into this case um, from legal perspective so a lot of uh, media outlet without uh, looking into uh look without looking into the tech, technical uh side of it just declared it some kind of big reform some kind of big victory of uh, um of the justice but this is not the case basically supreme court defined the authority uh which the right appropriate government to give the mercy not challenge the um, right of the government to provide remission in such a cases so maharashtra government would be the right and appropriate government because this case was um heard into the uh, maharashtrian court so that was the uh, that was the one aspect so still maharashtra government can provide mercy if they want to uh, so also when you see this thing that the government if the government changes the, the uh, outcome can be different it also take us into a territory of uh, appeasement politics so it says because uh, gujarat government provided a uh, mandate in maharashtra and gujarat in both Um, both of the state bjp is in the power but because these people are local uh, of gujarat uh, population so they should they would get a mercy because of appeasement politics because they come into certain kind of uh, com- they belong to certain kind of community which which can be categorized as the uh, voter bank of current <laughs> government in uh, gujarat so that that's why their uh, decision would be biased however at the same time the supreme court is trusting maharashtra uh, government to give right kind of decision because these people cannot uh, be categorized as their voter banks so they would be more fair there and this uh, make you, this um, this uh, makes you uh basically think that what ha- what we have what have changed basically it is still appeasement politics different identity different kind of community but the same uh, pattern and if we really want to change india on the gro- ground level on the root level we have to s- ask for fairness we have to ask for our institution to work better without any biases we have to uh um we have to see that if our governments are not catering to the real justice so uh, this is the first uh, uh, first point of point uh, i have uh, explored and the second uh, uh, the second uh, layer i was looking into was patriarchy basically then how we intermingle the patriarchy uh, with the communal mindset so basically it comes from the idea that women are the wealth or women belongs to a certain community there is a no agency of uh, which women subscribe to there is no individuality and when we see women as a um, way to teach uh, a, a lesson to a community that's how we make a Uh, that's how we create a society which is unredeemable the, you should see women as a human being and any person in the sense and as an individual and you should not make them victim just because they belong to certain identity and same for the women however this is um, very this is the battle our society fighting for very long and a lot of 
societal reform would be needed the way we think at the society not only intellectual group the common masses we have to teach them we have to discuss this idea more and more frequently that you have to think in the individual term you have to think that a person is victim as long as they are have not they have not committed any crime and not even they have committed any crime the only institutional uh, 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 judgment and institutional justice can be the appropriate in any situation however because we know that uh, a lot of work has to be done in that area um, the best way is to bring forward more dialogue regarding it and uh, one of such and this mindset of uh, patriarchy is not only belo doesn't belong to only one community if you want to see there are so many such cases i mean i have cited how azmir 92 a rape case uh, goes into the same territory where all most of the victim were hindu women and the perpetrator were muslims and uh, there were not much actually action was taken and uh, due to their good connection a uh, political connection they easily get uh, out of uh, the entire situation so and even if you see the social on the social media you can easily see the across the ideological spectrum how women get abused threatened by by the violence just because putting the opinion out there which is not in uh, um, agreement of any individual um, male who subscribe to the patriarchal mindset and the best way they find to shut down a woman is just start abusing and doing the misogynistic attack on her so these are few uh, uh insight i have uh, written about and uh, also i hope that uh with the changing time we we uh, yearn for more institutional reform instead of being happy over just getting decision uh, in a favor we are in a favor of us or in in alignment of our uh, point of view we should look into the uh, real institutional reform and uh, doesn't matter if the outcome comes in our favor or not and second we should look into the society which become more uh, fair towards the women and don't see women as just uh, um, just as a property of the society uh, so uh, for more please go and read my article and uh, for more such a video uh, like subscribe Uh, the the print thank you